What is going on, Young Hollywood? We're here with Cher Lloyd in the amazing Young Hollywood Studios. Hi. How are you? I'm good, thanks. How are you? Very good. We're going to be talking about your new song, Activated. Yes. What is activated? What what does that word mean? For me, it means like being like pumped up and, and driven to do something, and that's why I wrote the song. At the time, I was just really determined to get something to my fans. Motivated. Activated. Yeah. It's like, or is it like I was thinking like I'm getting lit? Sure. <laughs> yeah. You can. It was more of like masked people and they symbolise something quite dark to me. I saw recently there's this thing that my fans are sending around on Twitter and they've guessed what they think it's about. Ooh. They're right. They're right. So I'm not going to reveal too much because I feel like my fans know me so well. They already know what those masked people symbolised. They're like, Ooh. So you're from the UK. Give me a little knowledge on where you are from in the UK. So I'm like three hour drive from London. I'm from a town called Malvern. Okay. And it's this small little town. We bottle water. Oh, so you have like a bottled water company in your town? Yeah, we've got you hills. Do. So oh. the, I think the water comes from the hills or something. We have like Morgan cars, like classic cars. We make those in our little town. Okay. Yeah, really spectacular stuff. Um, I'm quite proud of the little town that of I course, come from. I'm of really course proud. You are. Like my town has always been so supportive of me and rooting for me uh, ever since like the beginning of my career. So I love where I'm from. Do they all go to like an English pub when you were on X Factor and they were just like, yeah, go share? Them. Do you know what? Yeah. Kind of like the um, picture in there. Yeah, the pub around the corner put a massive banner up outside to um, like vote for me while I was on the show. It's a very tight knit community, and that's what I like about my little town. So we were just, as mentioned X Factor. Tell me what is that like? Because there's so many of these shows now. X Factor, The Voice. What yeah. if you had to tell like an artist that is going to be on one of those shows? What's some kind of advice you would give them? Do you know what? I don't think I can give advice. It's one of those things that you have to throw yourself into. I Social was 16. Okay. I knew nothing. Nothing. About the industry. Wow. And it was probably a good thing because I learned. Mm -hmm. You know, I didn't have people pre-warning me what was going to happen. I had to figure that out. And. For any artist, you do just figure that out. You don't just come in the industry and, and know that, oh, I should have a manager like this and I should have a record deal like this. You don't know it, you learn. I'm still learning. I still feel like I don't know everything and I never will. Right. I feel like we all should remember that. Always learning. Yeah, awesome. you can always learn more about your craft. Go, go, go links. That's what I call chain reaction. Don't think we can slow down. This drink threw me in the audience. So, okay, Cher, we love your Instagram account. Thanks. Pretty phenomenal. Uh, yeah. Let's get some Instagram. Oh, there we go. Oh, so, some thanks. Instagram photos right here of Cher Lloyd. So, what, tell us what's going on in this Instagram here. That's my little dog, Buddy. Wow. He was a bit naughty this morning. He, he did a wee, and that was nice to wake up to. He weed on something? Yeah, but I think he does it to get at me sometimes because he's such a well behaved dog. Mm -hmm. But if he feels like he doesn't want to do something, he'll do a wee which is annoying, but I love this dog. This dog is the funniest dog he looks hilarious. you will ever meet. Let's, let's see what else. What else we got on that Instagram feed? Oh, wow. Yes. Nice. Have you seen that stuff before? Do you know what those are? I don't know are? what it is. I was like, what is this? I'm gonna find out from Shirley. To remind me of home, I am so happy right now. Okay, so this is all British, UK, English candy. Yeah, it is. I stuffed my face with all of that. Oh, wow. I did. <laughs> that was gone in a night. 
because I went to the English shop in Santa Monica and I picked all that up and that very night all of that was gone. Which one was your favourite? I love Monster Munch, they're my favourite crisps. We do say chips here, we say crisps. Monster Munch are the best. All right, let's see what else we got here. What else we got on the Instagram? Oh wow, coffee tattoo show. Yeah, my husband took that picture of me. I have you have a tattoo right there, and you, of course, it's still there. Yeah, it's not um, going to go anytime gonna soon. Go away, yeah. No, it's not one of those that you used to get like on a bit of paper. Mm -hmm. You used to wet it, and then you'd have like the little tattoo, and mm -hmm. you'd be really sad when like your mum would say, "No, you, you've got to have a wash, have a wash." And you'd be like, "No, but my tattoo, mum, my tattoo." Can't wash my tattoo, mother. <laughs> Is that good? Yeah. No. no? <laughs> no. What got you into tattoos? Why did you want to? Why did you want to get tattoos? Um, I got my first when I was 16, mm -hmm. and my mum actually took me to the tattoo. 16. Yeah. Wow. Um, I'd been asking for ages, and yeah, I got my first tattoo when I was 16. I got a little bit hooked, to be honest. Yeah. I'd, I'm not sure whether I'll get more. Mm. It's, a, it's been a big debate for me. Do you need more tattoos? Yeah, just because I feel like if I get more, then I'm literally going to be covered, because then I won't stop again. Right. Okay, let's, let's get one more photo. We have another photo? Here we go, with this photo. I, it was something on your sweatshirt. I want to know what that said, and where is <laughs> this? Um, that's a lyric to Activated. There we go. It's one of my favorite lyrics, yeah. actually. No <laughs> swinging from the balcony with two cups, one in each hand. No Swinging from the balcony with two cups, one in each hand. Two cups, one in each hand, and I'm swinging from a balcony. Wow. So on I'm... what? Exactly. Like, what are you just swinging? <laughs> I know, like how am I swinging? That's awesome. That's being activated. That is what activating is being uh, activating is about. Yeah, because like clearly I'm not swinging from my hands. Right. You can do anything when you're activated. When I do the damn thing, just watch me. When I do the damn thing, just watch me. They're like, ooh, they're like, ooh. But I just want to put it out there. Please don't try the swinging from a balcony with two cups, one in each hand. We're here at the Four Seasons Hotel. We might try that afterwards. I'll do it. Yeah, Swing you do it when I've gone. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll just pretend this conversation never happened. Okay.